Hello. Uh, today I just want to show a solution that's been pointed out to me by one of my subscribers. And um, yeah, it's been really helpful because um, for a long time um, I've been using Crawler Process because I find it much more efficient to run my spiders from the command line um, using obviously using something like uh, Python 3 and then the name of a spider.py. However, when you use crawler process you and with items, uh, you may find that you get this module not found error. Now the reason for that is because it's not in the correct or this the uh, it's not in the path in which uh, the spider's looking at. So if we go into this and I'll just show you this the Scrapey framework creates project name inside the directory of the project name it creates another directory of the project name and then it creates you a spiders directory uh, with items.py is above that directory. Now previously you may have seen me um, do a bit of work around which was to move the spider from the spiders directory back up to the same level as items.py. By doing that it then um, meant that it was not needing to look elsewhere for that file path. Um, right, if we open up this you'll see, I'll just show you the fix um, and then I'll show you how it was before. So. Here we go, it's the fix. What I've had to do is use from sys import path and then do path append and then the full path of the top directory of my project. So forget bin, that's been created by virtual environment. So the name of the top directory is rsgate and then if if you've got a GUI then just do uh, properties and you'll get that full path so that's the path you need not not the inner one as I say Scrapey makes another folder with the same name which can get confusing so um, yeah I've got a folder called documents inside I've got my scrapers um, I called it R1, that was the directory of my virtual environment, then obviously it makes bin. So here, RS gate, and that is that very same path there. And then you call, oh sorry, you tell the import, uh, you tell it to look for your items file, your items.py file, you tell it project name.items. And then when you run it, you will no longer get this error. So I'll just show it working. Let's close that. Let's just run it. So sudo python3 rsg spider. So that's the name of my spider. And off it goes, and it's worked. Okay, what would it have done if I hadn't have put that in? Well, uh, Let's edit it in Genie, shall we? So without that, if I'd, um, let me just comment these lines out. So comment that out, comment that out. And then if I just had something like, the default from the Scrapey framework would have been from items uh, import rescape.item. If I'd left it at that, no module named items. And you may also have seen, um, you may also have seen people on Stack Overflow recommending putting um, period there twice, which Again, if I show you that, rerun it. 
from dot dot items import rsgate item attempted relative import with no known parent package so again that doesn't work so if we go back in and I'll put it back to the new the new arrangement so get rid of that and comment that and comment that and comment that so from sys import path it's these three lines from sys import path path append so we're telling python scrapey to also look in this path for rsgate item in the items.py file so save that save run again and there you can see it's worked again so no surprises there because uh, that's just putting it back to how it was so I hope this has been useful um, it's a very specific problem uh, that you will encounter um, if you run crawler process if you use items.py and um, you run you run your spiders from the command line which that's the whole point of using crawler process um, so yeah I hope that's been informative I'll put up some slides at the end for you to uh, peruse at your leisure so until next time thanks for watching